Hey, what's up YouTube? Today is gonna be my third try at recording Operation Critical for two days ago. First try had like a hundred pixels or so. Second try either forgot to press record or accidentally deleted it. Didn't know where it went. So here's my third try and the Gerhard video from today I had a really good one. But I thought it was a real smart idea to overwrite the file with another one. Thinking I had a backup. Nope. So Third try recording this curtain call, real awesome curtain call I must say, and I'm gonna do it a little different than usually it's not gonna be first and the last attack, it's gonna be every base but I try to pick out the uh, most epic attacks that I can remember. I had a note but I think my dog ate it or something. I don't even own a dog. So. Let's go in with biggest for the start. As you can see, Moet first attack cleared out a couple of defenses on the right. So it's a little easier for the landing and Captain F Spark is with it. I have no clue what ability but she dies before the ability is used. But we should make that. And uh, function so you can see what ability is used in the replay. <laughs> you now only see the hero that's being used. And it always glitches. It's, uh, it's still alive when clearly it's dead. So Biggest is doing it awesome job in clearing a lot a lot a lot of rock launchers and clearing most of the mines and as I most does this little puppy here is still standing artillery does not register when the attack is over so Nikki Nikki sorry Nico just gave you a girl's name goes in without hero I don't know why decides to take down the mortar and goes in from over there here's the little boom mark and a couple of rockets little in range so the shock was needed then an awesome duo from me and Rocky me clearing the start couple of mine and it, it doesn't seem like much DB but it really is if you're doing such a long run you need all the GBE you can get and yes I could have gotten a couple of here like Rocket's gonna do in the end but look at that ripping so tight one smoke and three shots. Of course, my surgeon brick died. If she hadn't, I'm pretty sure I would have had a solo. But can't win them all. I have no clue how much TB I had left. I might have run out fully that I couldn't even um, couldn't even start the ability. And this way, how it's grouped. It's a much cleaner run, but, 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 the end grouping isn't pretty. See, in the end, a big fuck you, I'm just going in. So, what's my shelf left? Great job, Rocky. Still think mine attack is bad. Haha. <laughs> uh, 
then Arcus with both hands also do the wow 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 way. They taking out the work launcher with TB, playing a couple of mines, and normally you shouldn't do that with credits because now all the mock launchers are aggroed and you have less time to pull the shots, but yeah, it, it, uh, Barrage was not uh, able uh, to do it. And if those credits were a little earlier, that laser wouldn't have shot and it would have been solo. And now his baby account did pretty much the same thing, so nothing so that. Uh, let's see. I missed Quantum. I oh yeah, missed the with the opening. And Louis with finished. RTO and Thunder Ness in the middle. You can see. All the right side was cleared and a warrior attack. The hookah with the beginning that's probably the most interesting to watch, but it's a simple clearing. So now you can see a little bit how we do things. The teammate and the warrior was not in the notes, so not as epic to show. Scarlet Witch opened up Dioxin. But the epic attack starts with Mr. Alex. You can see Scarlet did a great job at clearing the beach a little bit. And I'm pretty sure there was a rock launcher and a shot blaster there. So highly appreciate it, but I don't want to make this a 20 minute video. I cannot show all of you. I love all of you. Really loved all the attacks, but it's just too much time. Uh, speed things up a little bit. Alex does a great job in not losing troops in the run. And over here he makes it somehow so all the rock launchers are gone. And one of the shock launchers. What can we do about it? Mr. Nightso is pretty much gonna do the same I think. Well I think I know and then taking out all the shock launches. So then it's just a uh, let's see one two shock for me. And try to take out one more there so you can get all these in one go. But So the one who finished it was Mr. L. Stolne. I have no idea how to pronounce that in English accent. In Dutch we say uh, Strainer. But I'm pretty sure all you English talking people can't even pronounce it that way. You can see the two attacks in the middle took down cannons, three of mortar, and now it's just a uh, Two shock is the clean up. And then the last phase. Yeah. Three takedown and, and sabotage. Sabotage was just we had a lot of intel so much. Oh hey, 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 hey. I missed the first attack. HK boomer. Okay. Four This is the Captain Effort Spark trick. Use the remote control tech quick. And all the other defenses in the area will target it. Of course it doesn't work with uh, what's it called? Prototype uh, defenses. Would be kind of overpowered if you have a Doom Cannon. Adding extra health, adding extra damage to it. Would one shot everything. Or having a shock blaster that just annihilates everything around.
Get sent to excuse on all of the boom gangers. And it, it, it's, it's really costly in TDE because all the abilities cost a lot. You need a couple of flares, you need a couple of smoke. So here he pretty much runs out of TDE. Does a little bit of damage, but is not able to flare to the HQ. So Scorches run out of place and Sukas get smoked. Mad Hunter, same strategy. Don't really know why he used Ever Spark instead of Search and Brick. Having the extra damage here would be helpful. And the splash damage of the rockets is so great that most of the Sukas get destroyed so quickly. Can't really do anything about it. Plus, I have no idea what happened. But it's a great attack and so little left. And the last step. Yeah, team heads to take down a couple of power cells. And TBE for the finish. So that's how we take down Curtain Call. And I really hope this is. It's been bugging me for a long time. We're doing choke point for a couple of days. I'm pretty sure we're gonna do another Curtain Call this weekend. So go team and keep being awesome. Hope you enjoy this. and.